California's 2016 Title 24 is the current Building Standards Code. Part 6 of this code is the Energy Code, and Part 11 is the Green Building Standards Code, or CalGreen. Because Part 6 compliance covers new buildings and alterations to existing buildings for both residential and non-residential buildings, its requirements affect just about everyone. As a new building owner or an existing non-residential building owner or manager who is performing additions, alterations, or tenant improvements, you should speak to brokers, listing agents, or tenant representative brokers about the potential impacts of Title 24 to you and prospective tenants. Whether you are working with a tenant representative agent to find a new space or a listing agent to sell your building, starting a conversation with your broker early in the process sets boundaries and expectations for both sales and purchases. When looking to lease a new space or renew a current lease, it is important to discuss both the current as well as the desired energy-efficient characteristics of the space. This conversation will set the stage for Title 24 compliance with both you and your broker understanding the current efficiency of the space and your expectations. When looking to lease a new space, ask your broker if the building is already certified by LEED, Energy Star, Well, or Fitwell. Title 24 represents the minimum code compliance, and these programs are voluntary improvements that may result in a more energy-efficient building. Knowing what certifications are already in place can give you crucial information up front about the level of Title 24 compliance the building might already have. Many Title 24 requirements can be included in your lease, taking the guesswork out of negotiations. If you already have a green lease in place, be sure your broker understands green leases. Green leases, also known as high-performance or energy-aligned leases, are like a traditional lease, but include clauses or an addendum to align the costs and benefits of energy efficiency upgrades for both owners and tenants. If you don't already have a green lease, a knowledgeable broker may be able to help you add energy efficiency language to your lease. When selling, if you are working with a listing agent, notify them upfront about the energy efficiency features of your building. These distinguishing performance characteristics can set buildings apart. In addition, make sure your broker is considering the true value of a green building. Keep in mind that brokers are just one of several players in a typical transaction. When seeking an appraiser, also ensure they are knowledgeable about green building characteristics and are properly applying those features to the building's appraisal value. When looking to build a space, Ensure your designer has sufficient energy efficiency education, such as a LEED certification or similar third-party certification. Knowing the features that make a building energy efficient and are thus elements likely impacted by Title 24 can serve a dual purpose. In addition to being better for the environment, high-performance buildings typically have higher rental premiums, lower vacancy and turnover rates, and higher tenant satisfaction. This leads to a better bottom line for everyone involved. Second, steering your broker towards green buildings may make Title 24 compliance easier. Here are other questions to consider asking your broker. These questions can help you find the best possible building that is not only Title 24 compliant, but saves energy and money through lower utility bills and lower operation and maintenance costs. Are you looking for Title 24 compliance or to go beyond? Determining upfront your level of comfort with energy efficiency helps streamline the process. What components of the building already comply with Title 24? How old are the components of this building? Will they likely have to be replaced to continue to comply with Title 24 if Part 6 compliance is triggered by an addition or alteration? Is the building currently sub-metered for energy or water? If not, is it possible to install sub-meters? Not all brokers are educated on what makes a building green or high performance. However, by beginning the process of identifying a knowledgeable green broker early in the process, building owners set themselves up for long-term success. 
Additionally, as a broker, there is a proven business case for integrating green, high-performance buildings into their portfolios. Your broker should provide a pathway to success, not a roadblock. Having upfront and clear conversations about your energy efficiency expectations can help alleviate potential pitfalls. This video is brought to you by BOMA LA. With special thanks to these sponsors. Thank you.